Welcome to the studios of WCMU Public Television. This time on Quiz Central, Brethren takes on White Cloud. That's coming up next. Support for Quiz Central is provided by the CMU Bookstore. T-shirts, sweatshirts, hats, maroon and gold memories, and an official outfitter of Adidas apparel at the Central Michigan University owned and operated CMU Bookstore. Online shopping seven days a week at cmubookstore.com, on campus at the University Center, and game day locations at Kelly Short Stadium and the John G. Kulhalvy Event Center. Hello everyone, I'm David Nicholas. Welcome to our 19th season of Quiz Central here on WCMU. This time, students from Brethren are taking on a team from White Cloud. Now, before we kick things off, here's the format for our single elimination tournament. Two competing teams will be independently challenged with an identical set of questions. The school that answers the most questions correctly in the time allotted advances to the next round. We'll keep that process going until we crown a Quiz Central Season 19 champion. And at the end of our season, four lucky Quiz Central seniors will receive a book scholarship provided by the CMU Bookstore. And top teams from Quiz Central qualify for the NAQT High School National Championship Tournament. Now let's get to today's game. The first round is the Maroon and Gold Rush. Our teams will have just two minutes to answer or pass each question. Each correct answer is worth 10 points, no point deduction for incorrect answers. Students will be able to consult with their teammates on each question, but the final answers come from the team's captain. Let's get things started with the team from Brethren. If you're all set players, here comes your first question in the Maroon and Gold Rush. What word, which in most dialects is a homophone of a wood beam that connects two working oxen, means an egg's nutrient-rich yellow portion? Yolk. Yolk. That is correct. What 19th century British poet wrote about an elderly Greek hero who vows to strive, to seek, to find, and not to yield in the poem Ulysses? Okay. Odysseus. That is incorrect. What celestial body was discovered in 1846 based on calculations by Urban Lavarier to explain anomalies in the orbit of its inner neighbor, Uranus? Pass. Pass. George Gershwin wrote an overture named after what Western Hemisphere country whose musical traditions include the rumba and salsa? Next. Uh, pass. What 19th century author portrayed a Spanish servant's love for a queen in Ruy Blas and described reformed convict Jean Valjean in Les Miserables? Shakespeare. Pass. What present day country home to the 18th century Durrani Empire was later contested in The Great Game and lay between Persia and British India? Pass. What recipient of the 1979 Nobel Peace Prize, known for her blue bordered white sari, was an Albanian nun who founded the Missionaries of Charity. Pass. What adjective describes cells such as animal get? And that bell signals the end of that round. All right, White Cloud players, it's your turn. Here comes your first question in today's Maroon and Gold Rush. What word, which in most dialects is a homophone of a wood beam that connects two working oxen, means an egg's nutrient-rich yellow portion? Yellow. Correct. What 19th century yellow. British poet wrote about an elderly Greek hero who vows to strive, to seek, to find, and not to yield in the poem Ulysses? Kelly? That is incorrect. 
What celestial body was discovered in 1846 based on calculations by Urban Lavarier to explain anom anomalies in the orbit of its inner neighbor, Uranus? Uh, Neptune. That is correct. George Gershwin wrote an overture named after what Western Hemisphere country whose musical traditions include the rumba and salsa? Mexico. That is incorrect. What 19th century author portrayed a Spanish servant's love for a queen in Ruy Blas and described reformed convict Jean Valjean in Les Miserables? You go. That is correct. What present day country, home to the 18th century Durrani Empire, was later contested in the Great Game and lay between Persia and British India? Mughal. That is incorrect. What recipient of the 1979 Nobel Peace Prize, known for her blue bordered white sari, was an Albanian nun who founded the Missionaries of Charity? Mother Teresa. That is correct. What adjective describes cells such as animal gametes? And sorry, the bell does signal the end of that first round. Now let's take a moment to look at the questions that were missed in that opening round. The 19th century poet was Alfred Lord Tennyson. George Gershwin wrote uh, the overture named after Cuba. The present day country, home to the 18th century Durrani Empire, was Afghanistan. And the adjective that describes cells that contain a single set of chromosomes was haploid. Our first round wrapping up with White Cloud jumping out to an early 40 to 10 lead. And before we start the next round here on Quiz Central, let's meet the players in our game today. First up, it's the students from Brethren. Uh, hi, my name is George Phillips. Uh, I'm a junior at Brethren High School. I play uh, football and basketball, and I'm a Quiz Bowl fanatic. Hi, my name is hi, Alice Amstutz. I'm a Brethren. No, I'm a junior at Brethren High School, and I play basketball and run track. Hi, I'm Ian Scott. I I play basketball and football. I am a I am a sophomore at Brethren High School. Hi, I'm Olivia. I'm a junior at Brethren High School. I play four different sports every season, and I, this is my third year in quiz bowl. Welcome, Brethren. Good to have you here, and good to have you here as well, White Cloud. Let's take a chance to meet all of you. Hi, my name is Wyatt Carnes. I go to White Cloud Public Schools. I'm a junior, and I do cross country and quiz bowl. My name is Brian Schaefer. I go to White Cloud Public Schools. I'm a senior, and I'm the captain of the quiz bowl team. My name is Samuel Veer. I go to White Cloud Public Schools. I'm a senior, and I do cross country and quiz bowl. Uh, my name is Jared Willick. I go to White Cloud Public Schools. I'm a junior. Thanks, students. Now, the next round today is the Perfect 10. In the Perfect 10, our teams will be given a category, and they'll have 60 seconds to answer or pass on each of the 10 questions pertaining to that category. Correct answers worth 10 points, no point deduction for an incorrect answer. Our Perfect 10 category for today is Indigenous American Words. Give these words that originated in the languages of native people of the New World. All right, brethren, here comes your first question in the perfect 10. A soft shoe or slipper made of animal hide? Moccasin. Correct. Domed shelter made of blocks of snow? Igloo. Igloo. Correct. Thick roll of smoking tobacco? Cigar. Correct. North America's largest marsupial? The bear. No. Pass. Bat, Pass. Okay. Bat excrement prized as fertilizer. It's that one scat? Scat. That is incorrect. Sweet food made from cacao. Chocolate. Chocolate. That is correct. An edible gourd such as a pumpkin or zucchini. Squash. Squash. Correct. A loose blanket-like garment worn over the torso. And that bell signals the end of the perfect 10. 
Okay, team from White Cloud, it's your turn now to take on the perfect 10. Here comes your first question. Soft shoe or slipper made of animal hide? Moccasin. Correct. Domed shelter made of blocks of snow? Igloo. Correct. Thick roll of smoking tobacco. It's like a tent. Cigar. Cigar. That is also correct. North America's largest marsupial. Koala. Koala. That is incorrect. Bat excrement prized as fertilizer. Guano. That is correct. Sweet food made from cacao. Chocolate. That is correct. An edible gourd such as a pumpkin or... Oh, the bell signals the end of the round. Well, that concludes the perfect 10, but let's revisit the questions that stumped both of our schools today. North America's largest marsupial is the opossum. Finally, that loose blanket-like garment worn over the torso with a simple hole for the head was a poncho. White Cloud continues to hold on to a lead after two rounds now. The score is 90 to 60. The next up is the home stretch. I'll have more questions for our teams and correct answers worth 10 points with no deduction for any incorrect answer. Brethren, here comes your first question. Members of what branch of the U.S. military supposedly earned the name Devil Dogs for their actions at the Battle of Bellow Wood in World War I? Air Force. That is incorrect. The world's most populous francophone city is what capital of the Democratic Republic of Congo? Pass. Pass. What statistical quantity represented by the line inside the box in a box plot is found by putting a data set in order and finding the middle value? The median. Median. That is correct. DNA tests conducted in 1998 revealed that Thomas Jefferson likely had six children with what woman whom he enslaved at Monticello? Pass. What vessel owned by Juan de la Casa was the largest of the three ships in Christopher Columbus's first voyage and was named after the mother of Jesus? Mary. Mary. That is incorrect. Planck's constant divided by momentum gives the de Broglie value of what quantity, which is about 400 to 700 nanometers for visible light? Pass. Pass. What show featured Luke Kirby as a controversial performer, Lenny Bruce, streamed on Amazon Prime and starred uh, Rachel Brosnan in the title comic? Pass. Pass. What major river of Eastern Europe flows through Kiev before emptying into the Black Sea? Song. What? Song. 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 The Song. That is incorrect. What current Republican presidential candidate, Donald Trump's first ambassador to the UN, earlier spent six years as governor of South Carolina? Pass. Pass. What adjective can refer to major and minor keys with the same letter name to lines of longitude or to lines in the same plane that don't intersect? Parallel. 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 That is correct. <laughs> Heated limestone is used to make clinker, a key ingredient in what material that binds together gravel and sand in concrete? Pass. Pass. What character mutters puppy biscuit to himself as he imagines himself as a lawyer and hydroplane pilot in a James Thurber's work about his secret life? Snoopy. Snoopy. That is incorrect. What name was coined by Benjamin Russell in 1817 to refer to the apparent mood of national harmony 
during James Monroe's presidency? Pass, Jimmy. Pass. What party, which supported the American system of high tariffs and a national bank, was led by Henry Clay and opposed the Democrats in the 1840s? The Federalists. That is incorrect. The pre, pan, and PRD parties oppose what populist president of Mexico who was elected to office in 2018? Pass. And that bell signals the end of the home stretch. Next up is White Cloud. Here comes your first question in today's home stretch. Members of what branch of the U.S. military supposedly earned the nickname Devil Dogs for their actions at the Battle of Bellow Wood in World War I? Marines. That is correct. The world's most populous francophone city is what capital of the Dem a Democratic Republic of the Congo? Kinshasa. That is correct. What statistical quantity, represented by the line inside the box in a box plot, is found by putting a data set in order and finding the middle value? Meeting? Meeting. Median. Median. You have to speak loud. Yes, that is correct. I cannot hear you. <laughs> DNA tests conducted in 1998 revealed that Thomas Jefferson likely had six children with what woman whom he enslaved at Monticello? Hemming. That is correct. What vessel owned by Juan de la Casa was the largest of the three ships in Christopher Columbus's first voyage and was named after the mother of Jesus? Santa Maria. That is correct. Planck's constant divided by momentum gives the de, de Broglie value of what quantity, which is about 400 to 700 nanometers for visible light? Wavelength. That is correct. What show featured Luke Kirby as controversial performer Lenny Bruce, streamed on Amazon Prime, and starred Rachel Brosnan as the title comic? Pass. What major river of Eastern Europe flows through Kiev before emptying into the Black Sea? Pass. What current Republican presidential candidate, Donald Trump's first ambassador to the UN, earlier spent six years as governor of South Carolina? Do you have Pass. an answer? Pass? All right. What adjective can refer to a Pass. What adjective can refer to major and minor keys with the same letter name to lines of longitude or to lines in the same plane that don't intersect? Parallel. That is correct. Heated limestone is used to make clinker, a key ingredient in what material that binds together gravel and sand in concrete? Quick line. One more time, please. Quick line. That is incorrect. What character mutters puppy biscuit to himself as he imagines himself as a lawyer and hydroplane pilot in a James Thurber work about his secret life? Walter Walter Mitty. Walter Mitty. That is correct. And the bell signals that end of the home stretch round. Good job, players. Some tough questions in that home stretch round. Let's revisit the incorrect answers. The show featuring Luke Kirby as controversial performer Lenny Bruce was the marvelous Mrs. Maisel. The major river of Eastern Europe that flows through Kiev is the Dnipro. The Republican presidential candidate we were looking for is Nikki Haley. 
Heated limestone is used to make clinker a key ingredient in cement. The name coined by Benjamin Russell to refer to the apparent mood of the national harmony was the era of good feelings. The party, which supported the American system of high tariffs and a national bank, was the Whig Party. And finally, the PRI, PAN, and PRD parties opposed Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador. After three rounds now, White Cloud extends its lead slightly to 170 to 80 over Brethren as we get ready for today's final countdown. Teams, the final countdown will be your last two minutes to answer or pass questions. Correct answers, again, worth 10 points with no point deduction for incorrect answers. Brethren, we'll turn to you first to start off our final countdown. Two minutes are on the clock. Here comes your first question. What Mexican flowering plant with red and green foliage is named for a Secretary of War who served as the first U.S. Minister to Mexico? Pass. Pass. What amendment that provided the primary reasoning for the Brown v. Board decision was the second Reconstruction Amendment and guarantees due process? Is it the 16th? Due process is one of the first time, I think. Mm -hmm. Say so, 12th. The 12th. 12th. 12th Amendment. That is incorrect. What peninsula, which is separated from Singapore by the Straits of Johor, contains the southernmost portion of Thailand? Pass. What Japanese artist who performed cut piece is shown in an Abby Leibovitz uh, photo being embraced by her nude husband, John Lennon of the Beatles. Pass. William Shockley and Walter Schottke, confusingly both name types of what circuit devices, which ideally allow current to flow in only one direction? Pass. Pass. What holiday commemorated by a walk for freedom led by its grandmother, Opal Lee, became a federal holiday in 2021 and celebrates emancipation. Emancipation Proclamation Day. Pass. What man who overcame a severe stutter became king following the abdication of his brother, Edward VIII, in 1936 and was the father of Elizabeth II? Edward IX. Edward DeMette. That is incorrect. In an anonymous medieval romance, what Arthurian knight is given a year and a day to seek out and... Sorry, the bell signals the end, so we won't have time to uh, get to that question. Thanks, brethren. Now it's time for the team from White Cloud. Here comes your first question in today's final countdown. What Mexican flowering plant with red and green foliage is named for a Secretary of War who served as the first U.S. Minister to Mexico? Pass. What amendment that provided the primary reasoning for the Brown v. Board decision was the second Reconstruction Amendment and guarantees due process? Fourteenth. That is correct. What peninsula, which is separated from Singapore by the Straits of Johor, contains the southernmost portion of Thailand? Malay. That is correct. What Japanese artist who performed cut piece is shown in an Annie Leibovitz photo <coughs> being embraced by her nude husband, John Lennon, of the Ass. Beatles? I'm sorry? Okay. William Shockley uh, and... Yoko Ono. Okay, on to the next question. William Shockley and Walter Schottke, confusingly both names, uh, names what type of, what circuit devices, which ideally allow current to flow in only one direction? What is it? Pass. Right. Three weeks. What All right. What holiday commemorated by a walk for freedom led its grandmother, 
Opal Lee became a federal holiday in 2021 and celebrates emancipation. Juneteenth. That is correct. What man who overcame a severe stutter became king following the abdication of his brother Edward VIII in 1936 and was the father of Elizabeth II? George VI. That is correct. And that bell signals the end of the final countdown. Well, here at the conclusion of the final countdown, we have just a few questions that were missed. The Mexican flowering plant named for a secretary of war was the poinsettia. The peninsula that is separated from Singapore by the Straits of Johor was Malay. The Annie Leibovitz photo showing an embrace with John Lennon needed was Yoko Ono for that answer. William Shockley and Walter Schottke both name diodes. That anonymous medieval romance question that was started but not completed needed a Sir Gawain answer. And finally, the holiday commemorated by A Walk for Freedom celebrates Juneteenth. White Cloud takes the win today, a final score of 210 to 80. White Cloud advancing to our next round. Congratulations. We'd also like to thank Brethren for joining us. Good job today, players. And we'd like to invite you to join us again next week right here on Quiz Central. Or you can watch games anytime online at WCMU.org. Thank you and good night. Support for Quiz Central is provided by the CMU Bookstore. T-shirts, sweatshirts, hats, maroon and gold memories, and an official outfitter of Adidas apparel at the Central Michigan University owned and operated CMU Bookstore. Online shopping seven days a week at cmubookstore.com, on campus at the University Center, and game day locations at Kelly Short Stadium and the John G. Kuhalvi Event Center.